Chamber of Commerce just named a woman of the year. Now she's corpse of the month. I'm with the Federal Task Force on serial killers. Someone here could be the Deepwoods killer? Yeah, you know, sometimes these sickos get a kick out of seeing the suffering. Can you think of anything that might link these victims? Take a look at this. I thought you were with the police. Oh, I never said that before. Beginning, he was doing about one a month, as far as we could tell. He's speeding up. Mr. Miller, the detective? If he is a detective, I don't even know who he works for. You see him again, you just let me know. I know killers. Eventually, they, they crack. So serial killers don't make mistakes. You ever see a serial killer give himself away? You could see him lose control. Why can't you put him in jail? Well, it's not so easy to put somebody away if you can't link him to a crime. What do you want? I just need a few minutes. You know, we think that this killer, he gets friendly with his victims first. Is there, is there anybody else who's been hanging around? Which one is your car? What does this have to do with me? You can give me some valuable information about one of them. Who? Your brother, Tommy. Does he say why? I don't know why. Oh, you don't think Tommy? No, I don't think Tommy. He could never do those things. Not my husband. Maybe I'm trying to convince myself. Give yourself a break here, okay? The number Miller's doing on you, anybody would be crazy. All I'm saying is that the murders have everyone on edge. You have to understand. No, I don't have to understand. No! Why are you doing this to us? Why did you do this? They'll never find enough evidence against you. Tell me. <laughs> You don't even have a pattern anymore. Let her ask you. Three years I've been on this case. Every day. My whole life is finding this guy.